We'll get the first possession here. BYU to start with the football and run it from the end zone. This not a wise decision for Riley Burt. Taken down at the 13-yard line. And of 63% on the year. On the ground, this is Matt Hadley, and this is nothing. Wilson to the air for the first time. And the pass off the hands of Gunner. The tackle. Wilson. He is taken down. And Avery Williams is deep. The putt from Rent Almond takes a bad BYU yeah. bounce and doing on each and every play that they run. Four year starter for Boise State. And Rippin will dump it to Madison. Two straight touches. They're great on third down. And Rippin converts his first of the game. C.T. Thomas. And under center for this play. And a handoff. Up the gut. Madison got to the goal line. And Emmy, welcome to Boise. Kevin Brown, Andre Ware, Alex Cordry. Where the Broncos have second and goal at the one. And Alexander Madison is stood up. Shakir to take a direct snap. On third down, Shakir will take it himself. Fight for the goal line. Roll. Rippin gives it to Madison. Touchdown, Boise State. Didn't mess around with it. Got behind big Ezra Cleveland. You tonight. Keep your eyes on Lubbock tonight. Second possession for the Cougars. Three and out on the first. And Wilson with a completion of the flats on this play. The fullback, Braden El Bakri, fights for extra yardage. All the way to Canada. Another short one for Wilson. And this one to Dill from Zach Wilson. Talented true freshman. Had to get rid of that quickly. And that pass. Big third down. Wilson. He can run, and he does for the first down, sliding safe on him an awful lot throughout this game. Another quick hitter for the second time on this drive. A running play for Hadley, who is stuck. What is the difference when you say he's at ball at a very, very young age? Youngest to ever start a quarterback for BYU, but he cannot get away from big 90. Wilson in third and long all night long. Only a rush of three. Wilson gets it into the flats. El Bakri slips the first tackler and then gets knocked to the now, ground. Southam, the true freshman, for a career long, and it is short. Bill Shakur, he comes up short, and then Madison's able to punch it in on fourth down. Rip it on the run. That is... Could break that record of Ryan Lindley tonight. A little flip to Madison, who had six on the last play. And ducks ahead. Robert Mahone, the running back, back to the field. Rip in. He'll take it to the near sideline. Butler for a first down. A killian. In the middle of the field, and the seam route is there. Rippin will go to the near side instead. Look at this. Every play in college football is reviewed. What's the footwork? Left foot is dragging. That's a catch. And a heck of a catch. Richardson. And some free advertisement for the Orkin banner after the fact. Set up the screen. This is a tight end Chase Blakely. It is set up for Rippon. Rippon. Quick hitter instead. Touchdown Richardson. A.J. Richardson with his care who gets the credit. That ball came out late. And Boise State is on top of the football. Oh boy. They certainly thought they were. And there is the official signal. It is Bronco football. So first and 20. Rippin to throw, he's thinking end zone. Instead, he's gobbled up. A Fina. Rippin, after a strong first quarter, goes underneath short, and that pass is it all night long. 41 yard try, Hayden Hogarth. This thing is hooking, 
And it's wide to the left. You were, used the word calm earlier. That's exactly what the young quarterback has been. And Wilson will fire one here. And that one bends like an out route when there's a safety high on top. Heathel for 18. Now Wilson keeps it and fights his way with a stiff arm. Going to be his job, not if, but when. Wilson a first down throw. Strong drive after the missed field goal. And a handoff to Squally Canada, his first. He breaks a tackle and bounces ahead. Best offensive possession of the game. Wilson gets rid of it right at the sticks. Nice. Wilson on a second down. With time wow. and a rocket over the middle. It's Talon's quarterback as hot as Wilson. This is Hall, one of the BYU backup quarterbacks. And he spins away from yeah. one tackle, then gets knocked down. Why you would run that play? Third and goal, the freshman Zach Wilson. He'll throw a fade. That does not work. Southam. He's barely got it away. He laid next door in Boise. A great 2-15 upset. Here's Rippin on first down. There's a shot. It's intercepted at midfield. On the run back for BYU, Michael Shelton. And Shelton is knocked out at the 19-yard line. Didn't see the cornerback fall off. This looks outside. Defense. BYU ball, first down. If he looks outside, he's got a receiver sitting down in the flat that's wide open because the corner. Whether or not the folks in Provo love that, they like that play by Shelton. It's third career interception. A lot of motion before the play. And there's Jeff Grimes' offense. Wilson will wow. dump it off. Nice catch made. Wilson doing the same thing. BYU with one down lineman. And Weaver got a head start. Offsides flag thrown. First and goal from the five. Wilson chased and sacked. Yeah, just stumbled. Couldn't Boise it? State. Wilson chased again. And sacked again. Yeah, that's been milling around now like they're coming. Wilson trying to keep it. Tripped up and taken down behind the line for 43. Skyler saw them up, away, and good. A different area on the field. And so once you follow, you, your eyes can't follow the other defender. Hightower on the run back. There is a flag thrown. This is a big return that's likely going to be wiped out. Hightower will take it all the way, but there is a flag all the way back at the 15. It's for Hightower. Illegal block. Receiving team. Oh, oh, what no. a tease by Zubin. How about that, that Texas-West Virginia that game? Awesome. Game of the day. Here's Madison out of the backfield and with a step, Alexander. Rippin. Hit as he throws, got rid of it to Mahone. In 13. Need the 35. And Rippin hit as he throws. This one floats up there. Right Injury tackle, timeout. couldn't handle him. He's right off the edge, gets great push. And this is just around the edge, extend them. He'll get his team back in this thing before halftime. Fakes it to Hadley. And a first down completion, a broken tackle for Gunnar Romney and when to put something on it and when to take it off. Houston 20 after the penalty by Hodge. Hey, he throws a connection there. Again on the run, and Wilson will flip it into the next gear. Get out of bounds, yeah, slam it out. That could have easily been. Trying to get off the field and hold it just a field goal here if your boys. High snap, oh Wilson boy. bobbles it. Oh, disaster for BYU. Frazier. Thing yesterday, I didn't did. You? It's comfortable. Jabril Frazier is the king of chaos after a bad snap. And James Empey, the Boise, going to try to punch it in before the half here. Rippin goes short to Madison. And again, BYU has made it to their abilities. They've got six points out of three red zone jumps. And Boise can tack on with another short one to Madison. Left all alone out of the flats and into... Rippin. 
Middle of the field's wide open for Monster. He has the first down, and two flags are thrown well behind the play. Personal foul. Unnecessary roughness. Yep. Offense. Stats here. You're going to have to check this one down. They're not even going to snap it. That's the end of the first half. Brett Rippon's trying to argue that he called a timeout beforehand, but Brian Harson doesn't seem too perturbed. Sacks, they really got after him and caused a lot of problems up front. You see here, early in the ball game, can't escape, blown assignments up front by the offensive line. They get down in the red zone. Boise State makes some outstanding plays. And then, turnovers. Two turnovers in the first half, one on the kickoff return, a snap that was over the quarterback's head. Bird will take the ball to start here in the second half. And they will take it after a kick out of bounds. He likes how his defense got Boise State to get out of their rhythm. But with that said, it's pretty easy offensively. Three words, finish the drive. Yeah, Alex, you, know, you go back to Bo Bo gate drives. Those are drive coaches crazy. Madison with a hurdle. And all the way to the 40, trying to exploit that right now. They have Pistonian as a lead blocker, and Mahone gets the edge for another first down. More of a national level than There's they no used doubt. to, and they have quite a few players from Texas. Ball is boxed here on the handoff exchange, and this could be a self-inflicted wound for BYU, or for Boise State, beg your pardon. Gain, the fifth-year senior. Had a nice tackle earlier in the game. This is just a missed quarterback running back exchange. It goes on the ground, bounces around a couple of. So the first drive for Zach Wilson of the BYU offense this half, and Matt Hadley takes it off tackle for a first down run close to midfield. Matt Hadley, the converted linebacker, and we mean converted as of about three weeks ago. Wilson takes a shot for Shumway up in the air. He the outside climbs the ladder at 6'3", 210, and the eyes. That's how you win against coverage, inside and knowing where you're going all along with the football. 42 wide to the right. Five wide for Wilson. It's a quarterback keeper. He scores for the first time. In three weeks, B the BYU Cougars. Athletic, accurate, and poised. That is a dang agreeing to play that, you know, early in the season like that. Big Corbin Kafusi and the BYU defense back out there and Rippon's first throw. D'Angelo Mandel was in coverage, sets up second down. Rippon goes short again to Mahone. It almost seems when you're players or backs to run after the catch. A rush of only three, and the pass caught with the adjustment made. Grab here for this Boise State team that's so good on third. Another quick hitter. A block on the edge to spring. Boise State's only at the 37. It's a handoff to Mahone. Down to the 30. Quick hitter complete on third down. It is another. And resulted in first downs. Madison. This has the offensive line and the running backs turn to, to do work. Madison chased by Big Kafusi. Cuts it back in. First and goal coming up. Boise State hadn't made that mistake. Madison keeps it. Fights for it and pulls his way into the end zone. We won a lot of games in this with this program. It'll be 17 again this year as Dylan Colley takes it on first down. And Colley, 9% of the offense is on the shoulders of Zach Wilson. And their only touchdown on the ground. He takes it here. Wilson with a nice cut to get down to the four. Let him let it fly today. Give him more responsibility in this ball game. That's a backwards pass for Pau. He throws it, wow. and Bushman got it with one hand. The ball is knocked out. Was Bushman down is the question. He was not ruled down, and it's recovered in the end zone. The elbow touched 
He would have been ruled down, but from the replays I'm seeing, he, the hand touches and then the ball starts to come out. What a catch, though. Not sure if his backside touches and then the ball comes out. Ankle and right foot. When he came out, he was moving gingerly, not putting much weight on that right foot, and he's been limping on the side. If you can hold up against the pass rush. He had three scores against Air Force last week. A.J. Richardson and Monster. Third quarter, yeah. and here they go again. Well, they're kind of forcing, forcing Boise State to play this way just by the cuts. Mahone was nearly ripped down, breaks the tackle, and some wow. good, tough running. Looked like Mahone for first down. Yeah, Falatea almost had him in the backfield, and I thought he was stopped right there. There he is right there, Falatea, and it can't, he can't hold on. Is supposed to be the power runner. <laughs> right. They've had quite a few pushes from the line today. And now Mahone out of the flats for a good pickup on Fred. Doing it, and the guy's catching it like Mahone. Picking up yardage after the catch. Quick snap in here. Get it to. So you're going to have to start gambling a little bit in coverage. Only a rush of three, but still it gets to Rippon. And the pass appeared to be. Boise State great on third downs today. Eight of 11. And Kafusi gets to Rippon. Wow. This, he is some here down at the bottom. Rippon steps up. And he threw it too high for Monster. Incomplete. B 50 years of college football with two weekly series in history of SEC football and a whole lot more. Got a sneak peek of this uh, earlier this year. Freshman quarterback. Wilson. Here comes Frazier. Up stays Wilson. And look at this run by Wilson after the missed sack from Frazier. He's not going out of bounds. Barreling across midfield. To get away. And a big first down run by the true freshman. That was 23 yards and a few injury updates for some of you. It's later today. On second and long, Matt Hadley churning forward to the 40. Coming down short side of the field. No down lineman for Boise State. Yeah. The throw is reeled in by City just to get it out there. Wilson again with a scramble over the middle. And Collie. That there was a drop. I thought he caught it the entire time. They're going to snap it quickly here before this play can be reviewed. And pitch to Hadley. Oh, wait a minute. That ball was Hard snapped snap. before a whistle. The previous, no further review. My oh, goodness. Oh, wow. Come on. After further review, the ruling is an incomplete pass. You don't need to keep putting it behind the down and distance marker. Here comes Weaver. Wilson. He got wow. rid of it to the one time Boise State commit facing a second and 24 and he gives it to Hadley to the 34 yard line. Wilson pressured again. He'll run for his life and Wilson is tackled across the 41. Southam gets it up and it is Snap it with 12. Get it to Shakir. And BYU wow. is all over that. Open field play by Riggs Powell. He and Red Sandler. Go one more time for the head coach. A rush of three. Time for Rippin nowhere to throw. And he throws it very close to the line of scrimmage. It is broken up. And 76 yards away from a go-ahead touchdown. First play of the drive. A short pass. And a completion for him. They'll look to throw on second down. Flushed by Weaver. Get rid of it. Wilson get take him down. Get. He did not get rid of it. Throw it away. The sack from Tyson Maeva. Boise sixth of the night. Wilson third and long. The pass bobbled and incomplete. Right take down. That's usually in the area of holding. Steps up in the pocket nicely. And that's one cop. Boise State. 
from its own 36. And off Madison. Madison has the edge at a first down. And all he needs to get down to about five seconds before you snap it. They're snapping it way too early. Madison, nice stutter step moves to the front. Keep it on the ground. That is not what Rippon's looking to do. He's going for the kill, and he well overthrew Monster, so BYU can save it. Fully, he learned from, from that sack in the last series. A rush of three and a screen set up. It's Hadley with room. Hadley with a cut. Matt Hadley across midfield. Hadley all the way to the 25. And he gets up further, save the timeout. Now the clock's going to stop with a first down anyway, but how close this is between two Boise State defenders. He completes that screen pass to Hadley. Did you expect anything else from these two men at Albertsons? The back is Katoa, the fake to him, and the pass reeled in by Kali. First from the 13, Katoa gets the edge. Lopini Katoa out of bounds at the five. Tyson Maeva ran him out. 58 Katoa, seconds to go after a gain of about nine. Give it. And it looks as though you got hands on the hips for Boise's defense. And Krause chanting BYU. The offense wants some quiet right now. Hadley be back into the game. Yeah, be aware of the athletic Zach Wilson. Hadley taken down right at the line of scrimmage by Curtis Weaver. Sets up a monumental third down. Yeah, four down territory certainly, but they can get inside the three to pick up a first down. Would you think about a timeout if you're Boise State? Try to conserve some time in case they well, score? And I'm looking at my players with their hands on their hips. I might take that timeout to give them a rest. Hadley on the left side. He is stood up. Boy, I don't. I just disagree with the last two play calls. Five wide, no one in the backfield, but Wilson. They empty it out, and don't be surprised if he doesn't run the ball here. Wilson, he will take it, run to the left. He's got the first down, not the touchdown, and the clock will stop on the first down at nine seconds. They've got to hurry up. BYU sideline saying spike. Wilson spikes it. Seven seconds to go. Quick spike. Boy is going to head to the top of the formation, wide to the right. That's a long throw, will eat up a lot of clock. Collie the motion man. Seven seconds. Wilson, pressure. Wilson hit. Wilson, short. Boise State does it again. Unbelievable. On Statement Saturday, it is the Broncos' defensive line with the final word. You have to throw the football. During that timeout, Jeff Grimes should have been drilling it in Zach Wilson's head to get rid of the football. It's a catch and fire. We might be able to squeeze two, two plays out of this seven seconds. But if you hold it, this is the final play of the game no matter what and that's the that was the end result Let's take a look at it it's a catch and fire catch and it should be gone by now it's the final play of the game that should have been drilled in that young man's head whatever you do don't hold on to the football catch it and let it go